Only lost twice all year. 29 and 2. Brown oh. hits a three. Because they can knock down threes. They can get shots to the basket. Here's a guy who can knock down threes, and there's his first of the game. Baez misses the runner. Hannibal quickly back the other way. Open three from the right corner. That's six field goal attempts. Yeah, TSU right now starting to heat up. And it quick. Lob comes to Williams across the lane to McMullen. Now to Brown for three. It's good. And again, that's good when you're making them, but when you're not, not so much. Three left side. Brown. He. His dad's a former football coach at San Jose State, Fitzhill. Here's Brown, three-pointer, good, and that'll be a... Tevin Brown with his first look. But into the hands of Collins. It comes to Burns. Right side, Brown off a screen for three. Buried it. Your footsteps and in the footsteps of other coaches like Mark Gottfried, Mick Cronin, Steve Prohm, who've all coached at Murray State. Here's Scott Brown Ed for three. Scott Edgar, who opened Let's open up this game. And Murray State played a, a non-division one to open in Bellarmine on Saturday. And a good shoot. Brown, Hill across the midcourt stripe, goes deep on the wing. They leave Brown open for a three. He doesn't miss that. Something like 54 times or something like that. We <laughs> 54 free throws or something like that. <laughs> Devin Brown. Brown, step back, buries it. Everything coming up eight. Philip Russell had a shot block. Skipper Brown leads Tevin Brown. It's a three on zero. Fast break and a t rebounding lead for the Razors. Lob pass comes to Hannibal beyond the right elbow to Brown. Goes up for the floater and he finally got one to go. A little bigger than Joe Hampton. Stands at six foot nine. Brown pulls into a jumper an early five. And he managed both and he taught a lot of us about hard work and uh, you know how to balance your time and how to be successful at doing all of it at the same time. At and yeah, actually, that double dribble could, you know, all, all be it late in the shot clock. That could come back to be a blessing for Williams. Racers. In the corner. Hands of Brown. Racers can take the lead. It comes to Smith. Three for the lead. Good! What a pie on the far sideline. Finds McMullen. Bit of a high pass. Finds Brown. Lobs it down low for Williams for the easy. Now back to Hill on the far sideline. Cross court with a skip pass to Brown. Looks inside. A bullet for the dunk to Williams. 31% three-point shooter coming in. Patterson unable to handle the pass. Three-point shooting so far tonight, Richie, and kind of off to a similar start as Brown gets to steal. Shot clock for the Bruins. Pearson trying to get it inside and throws it away to Brown. Eagle digits now for the Governors. Fans wanted to travel on Paez. Don't get it. Carter had it knocked away. Brown comes out of there with the steal, and then we best at the league defending the three. They've done a good job tonight, holding the Razors just 5 of 19, but not as much from the two. And off the foot of KJ said, I'll hit it. For a guy with 17 points, that's his first points of this game. Turnover. Starting lineup back in. Full court pressure. Steal by Brown. He goes up. And Here's Hutchins Everett. McMullen's played a lot so far, and Tevin Brown scoreless. Or excuse me, Williams scoreless.